The rare earth element europium is part of the lanthanide series and was named after the continent Europe by French chemist Eugene Anatole de Marc. Europium is not found in nature as a free element, but is found in certain minerals. Europium tends to have a very small electronegativity value, but has a relatively large atomic radius in comparison with the other elements in the lanthanides. The soft silvery metal europium is a solid at room temperature. Its large atomic radius and lesser attraction between its outermost electron and its nucleus could explain its lower melting and boiling point. It also can become a superconductor if cooled below 1.8 kelvins, meaning it can conduct electricity without resistance. Europium is the most reactive element in the lanthanide series and displays two common oxidation states of plus 3 and plus 2. It also reacts quickly and strongly with water, yielding hydrogen gas, while its reaction with oxygen generates europium oxide. At 150 to 180 degrees Celsius, europium will ignite in air and catch fire spontaneously, and that should be handled with care. Lastly, europium has two naturally occurring isotopes. Europium-151 generates promethium-147 through alpha decay. On the other hand, europium-153 generates gadolinium-153 through beta decay. Europium also acts as a neutron poison in which it can absorb a large amount of neutrons, resulting in lower reactivity of the initial fuel load. It is also the fission product of uranium-235, but is destroyed because of its role as a neutron poison.